have to be your biggest fan. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nikki aka Ada Canada. If this is your first time coming across my channel, I hope that you don't make it your last. I hope that you do get to stick around to the end and watch this video as well as other videos that are on my channel. I hope that you do get to like my videos and subscribe. And if you're a returning subscriber, hi guys welcome thank you so much for coming back so today's video is going to be another episode in my study in canada series now i've been doing study in canada series since last year you guys know if you're an og you already know what's going on so most of the videos that i've done in the past in my study in canada series have been focused on university bachelor's master's phd and all whatnot just universities is what i have focused on and so there have been a number of people who have asked me for information on colleges so anytime i post a video on university someone is like what about cheap colleges in canada what about this college scholarships in colleges and all whatnot in this video today we are going to be tackling the colleges i'm going to be giving you information on the colleges in canada there are so many colleges in canada so i'm not going to list every single one of them i have seven cheaper cheapest I don't even know which one to use sometimes i feel like when i use the word cheapest it feels so weird because coming from an international student perspective tuition is just not cheap so anyway i have a list of seven different colleges where the tuition is cheaper than what you would get in an average college and it's more affordable it's lower cost and it's also good like you can use this college to get your PR after attending school the good thing there is that for all of these colleges virtually all of these colleges the application window is still open so far if you're interested in coming to study in Canada sometime in the fall which is in September application window is still open for these colleges and these are colleges that are definitely popular and definitely worth checking out out. you guys know the drill i will put the links to everything i say in the description box and i'll be giving you a brief description of what the tuition estimate is and also the kinds of programs that are offered in those colleges so links will be in the description box please endeavor to check out those links and do your own due diligence do your own research and go ahead and apply if any one of these schools interest you when i was doing my research i noticed that there are a lot of schools a lot of colleges where the tuition exceeds twenty thousand dollars some colleges is 25 thirty thousand dollars and all whatnot so i decided to narrow my search down to colleges that are less than twenty thousand dollars per year for an international student and i came up with seven there are probably more than seven colleges where the tuition is less than twenty thousand dollars per year but i decided to just include these seven because they are very popular there are a lot of international students that attend these colleges and i just want to keep this video as short as possible if there's a college that you do know about that i didn't mention it doesn't mean that the college is bad i just can't possibly mention every single college in this video otherwise you guys will get tired okay in no particular order the first cheap college more affordable college lower cost tuition college that you can attend as a potential international student is algonquin college algonquin college is located in ottawa in ontario there are three campuses in this college one in ottawa pembroke and in perth for a full-time post-secondary program with a regular tuition the average cost of tuition is five thousand seven hundred and forty dollars per semester there are two semesters that make an academic session which is typically one year in a college or in a university and so when you add 5,700 with 5,700 what you're going to be getting is $11,480 per year as a regular full-time post-secondary student. They do have diploma and bachelor's degrees in architecture, artificial intelligence, digital marketing, business as well as biotechnology and others. The second college on my list this one is a very popular college and it is Seneca College which is in Toronto in Ontario. The average tuition is is estimated to be between sixteen thousand to twenty thousand dollars per year. I put this in a range because if you check the link 
for Seneca tuition, you're going to find that it depends on the program that you're studying. They have certificates, they have graduate certificates, they have diploma, and they also have bachelors, right? So it depends on the program that you're studying. And there are links to each of these programs that will take you directly to see how much tuition estimates that you'll be expected to pay as an international student for that particular program. So when you look at, when I looked at the various cost i saw that most of them were falling between sixteen thousand to twenty thousand dollars and that's why i put them in a range so it all depends on the program that you're interested in studying and you have to go to the link directly to see how much you will be expected how much will be the estimate okay nothing is set in stone unless you apply and get admission they do have two year and three year programs the third college on my list is niagara college now niagara college is also located in ontario fun fact ontario has a lot of colleges ontario is like the educational hub of canada there are so many universities and there are so many so many many colleges that are in ontario i've i've seen schools that i've never even heard of in my life in ontario and you have students that are going to those schools so they have a lot of them over there so niagara college is located in ontario and there are two campuses in Wayland and Niagara on the lake. There is a tuition estimate calculator that's going to calculate how much tuition estimate for your intended program of choice. And this estimate depends on the program that you want to study. So for example, if you're interested in computer programming, the tuition estimates reads as $16,000 per year. If you're interested in electronics engineering, the tuition estimate is about $16,600 per year. If you're interested in a program like business administration with accounting specialty, the tuition is actually lower. It's actually $15,000 per year. Basically, the tuition for Niagara College kind of falls within the range of $15,000 to $17,000 per year for a potential international student. The fourth college that is on my list, cheaper college, more affordable and lower cost tuition college is Kamosun College. Kamosun College is located in Victoria in British Columbia. It also has two campuses in Lansdowne and Interurban. Tuition is estimated at $15,190 per year for a full course load. Again, it depends on your program of choice. They have different programs in arts, sciences, business, sports and exercise. The next college that is on my list is Humber College in Etobicoke in Ontario. The tuition estimate at Humber College falls between $16,000 to $20,000 for the first year. They have diploma programs in advertising, addictions and mental health, as well as bachelor's programs in commerce, business, finance and healthcare management. One of the perks of Humber College is that they have international student scholarship. I have talked about that scholarship in my most recent scholarship video. That video is supposed to be out by now. But yeah, I've definitely talked about that in my most recent um, scholarship video. I'm going to put a link here and also in the description box. So it's worth checking out if you're interested in coming to study at Humber College you should definitely check out the scholarship opportunity as well. The sixth cheap college that is on my list is Lethbridge College. Lethbridge College is located in Lethbridge in Alberta. Tuition is estimated to fall between the range of $15,000 to $21,000 depending on the program. Like when I check on these links i see so many numbers and sometimes the numbers will start turning my head so instead of just listing the price for each individual program i put it on a range it's easier for me to handle that way for lethbury college they do have programs in agricultural sciences nursing child and youth care as well as civil engineering the seventh and the final college that is on my list for cheap colleges in canada more affordable colleges in canada lower cost tuition colleges in canada is centennial college centennial college is located in scarborough in ontario tuition is estimated to fall between the fifteen thousand dollar to sixteen thousand dollar mark per year for your program of choice they have programs in nursing it engineering and public relations the tuition for nursing at centennial college is quite different tuition for nursing falls around that twenty five thousand dollars per year 
so it's that is the only program that I saw that was really on the high side but every other program that I saw the tuition fell between 15 to 16 thousand dollars all right guys so that is it for today's video those are the seven popular cheap colleges more affordable colleges and lower cost tuition colleges that are worth considering if you're interested in coming to study in Canada as a potential international student but you want to attend a college and not a university these colleges are worth considering these colleges are colleges where you can use them to file for your PR once you're done with your studies they have a DLI so I hope that you like this video I hope that this video was helpful to you please give it a thumbs up if you did share this video with anyone who is interested in studying in Canada on a budget more importantly subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel what are you doing hit that subscribe button for more videos like this don't forget to turn on your post notifications so that you will not miss an upload anytime I upload and with that I will see you guys in my next video until then stay safe bye